It's been over a decade since China expelled any accredited foreign journalists, and now correspondents there have reacted angrily after one working for the English arm of the broadcasting network Al Jazeera has been denied accreditation. Its Chinese bureau has now shut down, and a desk is empty where Melissa Chan once sat. She's an American citizen who'd been reporting from there since 2007. Al Jazeera has produced a number of critical programs about China in recent years, including one examining the alleged use of prison labour to make products sold in Western markets. Ms Chan is on the board of the Foreign Correspondents Club of China. The club's vice chair, Peter Ford, gave a telephone interview saying the decision to deny a visa undermines the freedom to report. Well, if the FCCC is appalled by this decision, it, uh, it would appear, although the Chinese government has not yet explained why they refused to renew Melissa's visa, that um, they did so as punishment for Al Jazeera English Channel for a documentary that aired last November that angered the Chinese authorities. Um, it also appears to be punishing Melissa herself for, for the tone of her coverage of China. And if that's the case, um, the Foreign Correspondents Club of China regards it as quite unacceptable that the government should use editorial content as a criterion by which it grants or withholds journalistic visas because that, that undermines Foreign Correspondents' freedom to report. And, and the government says that it strongly upholds that freedom. The Chinese Foreign Ministry defended its decision, saying it addressed the problem in accordance with laws and regulations. Accreditation for journalists has to be renewed annually. Al Jazeera, based in Qatar, said it would continue to cover China and hope to work with Beijing to reopen its bureau. I'm Marvereen Cole. That's all for now, but for much more news, go to our website, ibtimes.co.uk.